Hi, welcome to my channel. I am Mary Richardson. I am a psychic medium and I'm so glad you're here. If this is the first time you're here, welcome. If you've come back, I'm so glad you're here. Thanks for coming back. I intend to bring you messages on abundance and um, <clears throat> other messages as spirit leads me to bring them. And I want to do this message today. This is a message direct from Spirit, as all my messages are. This one I actually was given and I wrote down as I was channeling the message. How, it, how Spirit speaks to me is they give me the information, the message, and I am a clear channel to Spirit. Um, I talk with them throughout my day as almost like every minute I'm always chatting with them um, because they are guides, they are supporters, they are um, helping me and you on our highest and greatest, uh, what is in our highest and greatest good. That's always my, my intention when I ask them is that the message that they bring me um, is always for everyone's highest and greatest good. It is really raining outside my uh, my home. Uh, so the thunder that you just heard, yeah, it's raining like crazy. So I just wanted to uh, bring you that. <laughs> I just wanted to let you know that in case you heard that clap of thunder. Um, or maybe it was spirit reaching out. I don't know. Spirit said, yeah, it was us. <laughs> all right. So um, we all have guides. We all have um, what I call spirit, which is everybody. Guides, mentors, those have, that have passed on, the souls that have passed on that are here to help lead us and guide us to what is in our highest and greatest good. I just lump it all together and call it spirit. So my guides... Okay, so um, okay, so uh, if you hear me pause, it's just because I'm going back and forth with spirit um, because I want to bring you the most powerful, impactful message that I possibly can. And today's message, they're saying go into the message. Okay, so I'm going to read you the message just as I transcribed it uh, from uh, as I wrote it down as as spirit gave it to me. The message for today is you are abundantly abundant. Ask spirit to expand on the abundance you have and that you want more of. We are always available. We are always able to help. I'm sorry, I wrote this down so fast. I'm trying to read my own writing. <laughs> we are always able to help as long as it is in your highest and greatest good. We are positive, loving beings. <clears throat> Pardon me. Or energy. So we are always energy. So if you don't believe me, get an MRI, get an EKG. We are energy. So an EKG measures your heart rhythm, I think it's your rhythm, <clears throat> pardon, but it's energy, it's what it's recording. So we are always energy, and when we pass on, <clears throat> pardon me, um, our energy, our energy is still, um, our energy survives. So their spirit is saying we are positive, loving beings, or energy that care about your highest and greatest good. What holds you back is your own free will to make choices that aren't in your highest and greatest good. They're saying, read, read that again. What holds you back is your own free will to make choices that aren't in your highest and greatest good. We are all about love and what is in your highest and greatest good. You may call on us to lead and guide you at any time. So isn't, isn't that supportive? Uh, so 
of course we have, free, okay, so this is me now. Of course we have free will um, to make any choice that we want, even if it's not in our highest and greatest good. So you might try just asking that your guides be here and that they guide you onto your highest and greatest good into that they guide you in choices that are only in your highest and greatest good. And they're saying, they're saying end of message, end of transmission. All right. So that's spirit's way of saying, we got you the information that you most need. Um, all of my information is in the description box below. Check it out. Um, my website, my, I think uh, on my website, of course, in my email, you can book a reading, private reading with me. But most of all, these messages are to help you heal in whatever area you need to heal in. Um, I also am on Facebook, um, Psychic and Tarot Card Reading, Mary Richardson. And um, I do live readings as well. Uh, where I, you know, will pull a, 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 one moment, okay, where I will uh, pull tarot cards and read them live. So click on the like and subscribe button here. And also check me out on Facebook so that you'll be notified when I'm on there live. And um, so that you can get uh, a more direct more direct information, although this information is direct to you anyway, but um, so that you can jump in when I'm doing live readings also. Okay, so uh, Spirit is just reminding me things I need to tell you. Um, check out these messages. Even though you've seen the video before, when you're drawn back to a certain video, when you're drawn back, hi, everybody. When you're drawn back to, awesome, you liked and subscribed. Thank you so much, Brown Sugar. Awesome. When you're drawn back to these videos, that is spirit leading you back to watch the video again because there's another part of it that they will make known to you. Or they, it's the same video, but they will make different parts of it known to you, which is what you most need to hear in that exact moment. So if you're drawn back to the video, watch it even though you've seen it before and spirit may bring something forth that you didn't catch the first time that you most need to hear because spirit is all about um, all about kindness and loving and giving you what you most need to hear when you need to hear it. So whatever you're going through, whatever your struggles are, your challenges are, mm -hmm. spirits, they're going, hey, we're here. We're here to help. Just ask them to step forward and to guide you onto your highest and greatest good uh, pathway or path. All right. Hello. Awesome. So thank you so much for checking me out and for clicking like and subscribe <clears throat> and the bell button. So every time I'm live, you'll be able to jump in. I try and do these messages um, daily. Uh, and also I'm on Facebook. So I'll try and include the link in the description box from now on. So it'll be easier to go back and forth. Um, does anybody have any questions? Since I have some people here, this is awesome. I would be happy to pull a tarot card for you. <clears throat> Okay, brown sugar, you're the only one here. Is it all right if I pull a tarot card for you? Hello. Message from spirit, please. Gotcha. Okay. Hello. Everybody here? Yes, I'd be happy to pull cards for you. All right, so I'm going to pull a card for brown sugar. And these cards are from the Colette Brown Reed. Uh, they're oracle cards, but I like them. I use them a lot. I have a couple decks, so whatever spirit kind of tells me to use. And they're saying, use the deck in front of you. Okay, this is the deck in front of me. Awesome. Thanks, Brown Sugar. Hi, Tiffany. <laughs> so thanks so much for dropping in. All right. So all I do is I'm going to I'm just shuffling these. And I'm asking that. The card that is that brown sugar most needs to hear and that is in her high, his or her highest or greatest good that it 
be presented. And as you can see, this card, cards usually jump out. And Spirit also tells me which one. Okay, and they're saying this one is in your highest and greatest good. All right, so brown sugar. <clears throat> Sacred pool. Let me hold it up a little more. Sacred pool. So this card is, oh, interesting. Okay, so as I'm looking at it, Spirit is giving me information. So what they're saying is that you, <laughs> they're saying that, hi guys, thanks for jumping in. They're saying that, this is for brown sugar, that all of the energy, knowledge, wisdom that you most need is being poured into you like a sacred, it's pouring into you like you're a pool and it's pouring in all that knowledge, wisdom, energy, love and life is being poured into you so that you may use it for your highest and greatest good. And they're saying in transmission. So that's for brown sugar. Awesome. Okay, good. So I'm going to move on. Um, I see when some, somebody here, me, me, saying, can I have a reading? So this is for the person that typed me, me, can I have a reading? Of course. Um, these are just mini readings. I'm just pulling a card for whoever wants one. And Tiffany, I see you're there. I'll get uh, your card next. But this is for the person that typed in me, me, can I have a reading? Uh -oh. Just a moment. I dropped the card on the floor and spirit is like, those are the cards for me, me. So hold on. I'm going to go pick those up. All right. So these cards... So as I was shuffling my deck for the person that typed in me, me, can I have a reading? Two cards popped out and actually fell on the floor. So that's Spirit's way of saying, boom, these cards are for her or him. And they literally like threw them on the floor to separate them from the deck. And then as I was picking the cards up, they said those two cards are for that person. All right. So these two cards... They're saying, the first card is spirit of place, spirit of place. It's a beautiful card. And you can see how the person is actually connected to mother earth. Uh, this person has leaves like attached to her hair. And she's actually looks like she's coming out of the earth. Like she is attached to mother earth. Okay. So what spirit is telling me is that grounding is in order. Grounding means that there are different ways to ground yourself. What I do grounding means that we connect to, in this case, mother earth and we ask that, um, okay, so I'm going to, Spirit is saying, give you a visual. Okay, so the visual is that, the visual for me, me, is that how I do grounding is I imagine out of my feet, I have two cords that go to the center of the earth and wrap around a huge, ginormous log, tree log. And one cord comes up and removes everything that's toxic out of me. And it's continually doing that. And the other cord, I ask that love and above flow through me. So love, peace, joy, enlightenment, grace flow through me. So one cord removes the toxic things out of me that need to come out. And the other cord brings in love, joy, peace, enlightenment. So they're saying, Spirit said to me, from for this card, grounding is in order for you, me, me. So you may try that. See if that helps you to get rid of some toxic things. And they're saying, and bring in light. 
They're showing me bring in light. Okay, now they're saying go to the other card. All right, this other card is for me, me. <laughs> and this one says education. You can see a lady sitting there with a book. It looks very peaceful. You can see there's a little bit of light on her, almost in her throat area. Spirit is like, yes. They're saying, they're saying, speaking, speaking will be your gift. You already have it. You need to learn how to bring out what is most in your soul. And they're saying, learn how to do that. Reach out, ask us for guidance. And they're saying in transmission. And I hope that resonates with you. I'm just channeling what spirit is telling me using the cards. They're saying there's a bit more. They're saying these messages are all about love and light for you, me, me. That you have a gift of speaking truth. And they're saying in transmission. So they're saying you have a gift of speaking truth. Awesome. Congratulations. That's awesome. And they're all about love and light. So we all have gifts. And it helps to know what it is. All right. <clears throat> Uh, Tiffany. Hello, Tiffany. You're new to this. Well, it's okay if you're new to this because uh, when we are drawn to things that are like this, it's almost like our soul is craving it. So I know what that feels like. And um, I have lots of videos on YouTube. You can all watch them. I bring you daily abundance messages, which are just for your abundance. And I channel spirit in those messages. So I'm going to Okay, so Spirit's saying go into more about abundance. So <clears throat> abundance is anything that we would like more of that is in our highest and greatest good. So abundance can be anything, um, you know, whatever it is for you. And I am doing a 30-day challenge, and you can start today. Check out my abundance message. All right, so they're saying um, to refer you to that so you can check that out, but so that I don't hold everybody else up. Um, I'm going to keep going with the cards because that's what Spirit's telling me to do. All right, so these cards, I'm just going to shuffle this. the cards. This is for Tiffany. And I think your name, P-O-U-L-I-N. And I'm so glad that you guys came by. Thank you so much. Don't forget to click like and subscribe and the bell button. So every time I'm live, you will be notified. And I don't know if you saw that, but this card just fell out. I hope so. And as it fell out and hit my desk, Spirit's like, that's her card or his, her card, her card. All right. So Tiffany, this card is, ah, this card is balancing act. Balancing act. Let me bring it a little, a little bit closer. Balancing act. There's a little glare. I'm sorry for the glare. Okay. So if I pause, guys, it's just because I'm getting messages from spirit. And I'm trying to, like, make sure I hear everything. So for Tiffany, they're saying, see how these... They're almost like rose petals. They are rose pet petals. They're saying they are rose petals. These rose petals are falling. These are Tiffany's seeds of greatness. And they're saying, find a better balance in your life so that you can plant the seeds of greatness. And they're reminding me they're reminding me that thoughts are seeds. Thoughts are seeds. So for Tiffany, they're saying that, that your thoughts are seeds and you need time to think your thoughts, which are seeds of greatness. 
So balancing act is all about even giving yourself a few minutes to just think your great thoughts because those thoughts are seeds to bring you what you what is in your highest and greatest good. Spirit is like, yes. So Tiffany, um, I, it doesn't mean like you have to spend hours and hours meditating. I don't do that. That's not how my brain works. I can meditate while I brush my teeth because it's quiet and I'm just talking to spirit. So whether you're drinking a cup of coffee or tea or you're eating or whatever quiet moment you have, try and have a few more moments. They're saying a lot. They're saying have a lot more moments of that, of quiet, where you can think your seeds of greatness. And they're saying that is all in transmission. Okay, so that's for Tiffany. All right, I saw um, Filson Hope, F-I-L-S-A-N, Hope. So if you would like, of course, you wrote, can I have a reading? Yes, so I'm going to pull a card for Filson Hope. And I hope I pronounced your name right. Um, <clears throat> and Tiffany, you're very, very welcome. And don't forget to click like and subscribe. So every time I'm live, you'll be notified if you click the bell. Hello, Rochelle. Yes, so you'll be next. And I'm just pulling one card or two cards for everybody, whatever spirit tells me. And I'm going to do this as long as I possibly can to get everybody a card. Because I know what it's like when you jump on and like somebody doesn't have time. And it's like, oh, <laughs> so I'm going to try and do this for every single person. All right. So all I'm doing. Okay. Okay. So for Filson, Hope, Spirit is saying, the, the card that I had my thumb on and they're saying the card beneath it also. All right. So if you have one card or two card, it doesn't mean you get less. If you have one card, it means that all that information is in one card, but sometimes spirit, spirit leads me to two cards. All right. So let's move on. Uh, okay. So the first card for Filson Hope is that it says flying. And this is a beautiful card. Can you see the horse? And it has rainbows on it. And it's like a party. And it's joyous. And the horse is just like. Okay. So I'm spirit is saying, Phil and Hope, they're saying, To beautify, joy beautifies you. That joy is abundantly around you. And they're saying the energy that you produce, you share with others. And it's almost like I'm, I'm getting the feeling that I'm getting a, a picture of a person just smiling and people just love to be around you that they are just because they're picking up on your amazing energy, your amazing goodness inside you. And they're saying hone that, channel that into help others heal. And they're saying like yourself, like me. They're saying hone that, channel that to help others heal. And they said, it will make you feel like you were flying through the night sky. And they're saying, yes, we said night sky. They said that. They're saying that's all with that card. Go on to the next card. So this card is for um, Filson Hope also. This one is Golden Palace. Golden Palace. Okay, so they're saying all the riches, all the treasures of what would be similar to the golden palace, you see it's like gold all over, is in your heart center. And they're saying you share your heart center. They're saying share more of your heart center. 
because that is your golden palace. And I hear somebody saying, how? How do I do that? By opening up and being real with people. People need to hear what you have to say from your heart. And, and I said, is there more? And they said, that's, that's all. They say that you got it, that you understood. So I hope, so I trust spirit. Um, they're saying in transmission, go on to the next one. Okay, awesome. All right. Happily ever after. I see you there. And you said, may I get a card? Of course. And then Rochelle will be after happily ever after. Okay, so spirit said, so <laughs> I'm holding the cards and they're saying in your right hand, that's the card. All right, so happily ever after. This card says come together. Come together. And we have two giraffes and they're producing hearts. And at the top, sorry, I'm flipping the cards. At the top, there's like a crane. And Spirit is saying, stretch to reach your greatest good, for there lies what you most want. They're saying, reach out to us to help you in that stretch. We can help you reach your greatest good. And they're saying, don't fear the stretch. You can see how the, the giraffes are really stretching. They're saying, don't fear that stretch to your greatest good. They're saying, because we are with you. We are helping, we're, we are helping and guiding you through that process. And they're saying in transmission. Okay, all right, the next one, Rochelle. Welcome. And everybody, please click the like and subscribe button. Don't forget to click the bell button so you'll be notified every time I do a new, um, a live, uh, a live, I don't know what you want to call it, demonstration, reading, healing. Okay, Rochelle, they're saying these two cards. The first one is. Oh, they're saying do this one first. They're saying spark. Spark. And it, this is a beautiful card. This lady is playing the violin. And it's almost like you can see that from that violin playing is just magnificence coming from that. And they're saying... They're saying the tangible world holds you back from seeing the spark of your thoughts. And they're saying, do, do, do the positive things anyway, even though the tangible world may feel, even though it may feel like the tangible world is holding you back, do the positive things anyway. And they said, and you will see sparks of joy. And they're saying next card. Okay, the next card, this is for Rochelle. This says magic stream. This is a cool card. Magic stream. And I'm sorry for the glare. And you can see the abundance flowing down the stream. It's like a sheet of just pure, they're saying abundance flows through you.
And they're saying you are a clear channel to spirit too. And they're almost like showing me that this, this stream is your channel to spirit. So it's powerful. It's clear, just like clear, refreshing water. And it's forming a clear channel to spirit. And they're saying, you can talk to us anytime. You are a clear channel. They're saying what you need most is to believe in yourself. And they're saying that is all. And that was for Rochelle. Gratitude, joy. Hi. Hi. Thanks for stopping by. And AP, I will do you two next. So I'm, the next one, I'm going to do gratitude, joy. And I don't know if you saw it, but this card just fell right out as I was shuffling. And Spirit is saying, that is the card that's in gratitude, joys, highest and greatest good. And this one is golden palace. So even though I might have pulled this card for someone else, it can have a di completely um, unique meaning for each, per each person. So they're saying golden palace for gratitude, joy means that your seeds of greatness are in the golden palace. The golden palace is your heart center, your seeds of joy, your seeds of, your seeds of goodness are clear knowing. They're saying you have a massive clear knowing of us. You can tap into that at any time and ask us for more if that is what you desire. They're saying, they're saying, repeat it. You can tap into your heart center to get more clear knowing from spirit if that is what you desire. And they're saying in transmission, and that was through gratitude, joy. So. Whatever we want more of from spirit, we can just ask them to say, we can just ask them and say, hey, can you please bring me more? I sometimes even ask spirit if I'm, uh, if my connection to them, if I feel like, um, like my attention's diverted in a bunch of different directions and I'm having trouble like uh, hearing, hearing them, for lack of a better word, I ask them to turn up the volume. Hey, can you turn it up? And they do. Another example is if I'm trying to sleep and I'm just having a really hard time sleeping maybe or because my brain, my logical brain keeps going about what I need to do. You know, we all have a task list. And if I'm trying to sleep and my logical brain won't quiet down, I ask spirit, please help me, help me sleep, help me. And, and they do like every time. So those are things we can do as well. Um, Okay, I said the next one was ITBE Polo. ITB Polo. Hi. Um, oh, thank you, Gratitude Joy. You wrote beautiful. Thank you so much. So, this is for ITB Polo. And this will be, I think, the last one I'm going to do. Oh, thanks so much, Gratitude Joy. This will be the last one I do because I think this will get everybody. Oh, and AP, AP, I just saw you. I'll do you after IP Polo, and that will be, and that will be the last one. Okay, so Spirit is saying, hold on. Spirit is saying, do I do AP first? AP, I apologize. I will do you first, and then I will do IPB Polo, and that will be the last one. All right. So thank you, IP Polo, IPB Polo. Thank you for waiting. Uh, one minute. AP, this is for you. And Spirit just said, the card that I had my thumb on, that's your card. And they're saying, and the next one too. So the, that's the blue card. And oh, now they're saying shuffle for the next card. Okay. So as you, could you tell three, like two other cards fell out? So AP, they're saying three cards for you. Again, if you get one card, three card it, cards, it doesn't mean 
one card is less of a message than three cards. It just means that the message for a person that gets three cards, it's just divided into three cards. Uh, one card usually will have all the info, but sometimes three cards. So don't feel like you got less if you only got one card. All right. So AP, this first card, oh, they're saying do the bird first. Okay. This one is called intention. This is a really interesting card. I like it a lot. You can see the bird has a branch in its mouth and spirit is telling me to focus on the egg. The egg holds all your joy, all your goodness. And they're saying you have to crack it open. And spirit, okay, so cool. So spirit, in my mind's eye, sometimes they'll give me a visual and spirit is showing me like a big hand on, and they're saying, you, you have to crack the egg open. So AP, they're saying you have to crack the egg open. And what you'll find there will amaze you. And they're saying in transmission. All right, next card for AP. They're saying do the flying card next. The flying card. This is a beautiful card. They're all really beautiful in their own way. This has a horse flying. But what they're wanting me to focus on is the horse taking off. Like taking off. You're saying you will take off in your abundance once you crack the egg open. Cool. They're saying you will take off in your abundance once you crack the egg open. And they're saying in transmission for this card. Okay. The next card for AP. I know, right? AP said, wow. I'm like, I know. I'm hearing this as you're hearing it. That's the cool thing. So this card is for AP. It says cleaning house. Cleaning house. And they're saying hold it straight. And they're saying focus on the branches. Okay, they're saying if you have too many branches in your life, it will diminish your effectiveness. And I, I'm kind of asking like branches, like what do you mean, like in what regard? And they're saying AP will know. So the message is if you have too many branches, it will diminish your effectiveness. And they're saying... And I don't know if you're male or female, but they're saying she will figure it out. And the branches lead. The fewer the branches, the better. The fewer the branches means more goodness to you. And they're saying in transmission. All right. So that was for AP. Awesome. AP wrote, oh, I know exactly what that is. Awesome. Good. So a big part of. If you're doing this, doing readings, a big part is just trusting spirit. Like I just trusted spirit. They said, uh, she'll know what it means. So awesome. And you said, AP wrote, I'm trying to focus on what's important. And this reading is spot on. Awesome. Okay. So real quick, AP um, asked me, can I please just ask a quick yes or no? And I just said yes or no. And spirit said, definitely yes. Definitely, yes. So keep in mind, spirit's only about love and kindness and goodness. And AP, I just asked without the, the knowing of what the question was, I said yes or no, and spirit said definitely yes. All right, so now I'm moving on to IPB Polo, who's been really, really patient. Thank you for letting me bump you in order to do AP, which I promised to do. Um, so IPB Polo, thank you so much for waiting. And guys, please click like and subscribe and don't forget the bell button so that you'll be notified when I'm online. Okay, so these two cards just dropped out and, they, and Spirit is saying these are for IPB Polo. All right, so let's see what they are. <laughs> awesome. 
<laughs> okay, they're saying do the Golden Palace first. All right, so this one is Golden Palace. And even though I've pulled this for other people, it has unique meaning for you, for each person. And they're saying focus on the moon. Oh, this is cool. And they're saying the moon shines brightly even during the day. And they're saying that is you. Oh, hold on. <laughs> they're saying that's not exactly what we said. All right, hold on. Let me get this. They're saying the moon shines brightly and that is you. You shine day or night. But oh, they're telling me, listen, they're telling me, listen. The moon shines brightly and that is you. Whether you are high in the sky or low, you are always shining your bright light. Those around you Feel your connection to spirit and rely and trust on you to deliver the messages, the message to them that they need to hear. You are the moon shining bright, brightly. whether it is, it is day or night. You are the moon shining brightly, whether it is day or night. You're saying in transmission on this card. Go on to the next one. <clears throat> this one is spirit of place. Again, this is really cool. And they're saying focus on the ear. They're saying the ear is unique, just as your gift is unique. And this is for IPB Polo. You hear what needs to be said, but you're not saying it. You hear us frequently, and they're like, frequently. Don't be afraid to say what you are hearing because it is for your highest and greatest good and the highest and greatest good of the listener. We are all about love and kindness. We will not bring they're using a word uh, they're not we will not bring. They're saying we will not bring any demons. So I don't know if that's something you were worried about, but Spirit is saying we're we are all about love and kindness. We will not bring any demons. So if you were worried about that, don't be. They're saying we are not capable of channeling. Oh, they're saying you are not capable of channeling anything negative or hurtful. So, so that's really reassuring because um, that is really reassuring because that is saying um, that we all have a frequency or a vibration. And like for me, I can't channel anything that's lower than my vibration. Like it's not they're saying allowed. It's not allowed. Like I couldn't do it even if I wanted to, which of course I wouldn't. But they're saying for you, your vibration is very naturally high. And they're saying you bring in goodness and above. They're saying you bring in love and above, which is love, joy, peace, kindness, goodness. And they're focusing on, they circled like joy. They circled joy. And they said, that's what you bring. And they're saying, use your gift to help others in your unique way. 
which uh, is of kindness, joy, and peace. And they're saying in transmission. Okay, so I hope that helped you guys. Uh, thank you so much for dropping by. I just feel so honored that you're here. It was my pleasure. And I wish you God bless all of you. And I always, um, in my own way, like bless you. And, and um, okay, so they're saying, tell them about the blessing ball of light. All right, really quick before I, I, I drop off, the blessing ball of light. Okay, so IP Polo is asking one question here. Is, uh, yes, I can answer that real quick. Okay, so Spirit said no, and it is in your highest and greatest good. Don't kill the messenger. <laughs> so Spirit is saying no, and it is in your highest and greatest good. So sometimes the, okay, so they're saying go on. Okay, go on. Um, okay, and they're, they're saying that you will figure that out. And they're saying in transmission for that. Okay, so the blessing ball of light is something that I learned uh, where it's like a, a ball of light that's filled with everything we most need as individuals. And my greatest wish for everybody is that I send everybody a blessing ball of light into them, uh, however you, you know, into your heart center, your head, whatever chakra it needs to go into, and it will open up like a flower and give you everything that you need. So need, that is a need or want that is in your highest and greatest good. So I send you all blessing balls of light, which are filled with everything that you most need or want. Oh, you're welcome, my people, hello. Thank you all for coming. I'm going to drop off now. Goodbye. And please click like and subscribe. Check out. I have lots of YouTube videos out there if you're wanting more, especially on abundance. And don't forget to click the bell button also. Thank you. Goodbye for today. Oh, AP, you real quick. You're saying is M in love with. Okay. So. Oh, I'm, I'm just reading the comments. Sorry. Spirit saying that's enough in transmission. All right. So goodbye for today, everybody. Thanks so much. And I wish you all the best. God bless each and every one of you.